Hello, this is Eddie. I just want to share with you a little bit about uh, the ministry I have online here at chessworld.net. Okay, I've been playing chess with people from 153 different countries. Um, they um, call me the missionary. I have the Israeli flag. And so just these two, this combination, generates a lot of questions. And between moves, like, okay, it's my opponent's move here, I think. No, it's, it's my move, okay? I didn't confirm it yet, okay? And I might say something like, um, hi, guy. So, but the conversation, you know, it kicks off. We start talking about the Lord and everything. It's really, whoops, let me make that move and confirm it. I just sent the message without the confirmation. Okay, now um, I want to show you, okay, I have 10 boards waiting for me. Let me go to the next one, show you something. This guy is from North Carolina. Okay, looking at this board, I'm a piece up on him. And, uh, well, okay, I'm not going to try to make this move right now. Board's a little complicated. But uh, I can choose my opponents by different countries. And um, that's really awesome. And, like, when uh, Russia invaded um, Georgia, I played people from Georgia and, you know, was, was cons uh, you know, be able to comfort them between the moves with, you know, what I had to say and share. Um, different areas. Um, Israel. Oh, that was one of my um, pet peeves right there. When I first got here, I uh, found this site while on exile in, in, in Besheva. This is where I came and I invited people. We played tournaments and everything. I became friends with quite a few of these guys. Unfortunately, I've been on house rest all the time, and I haven't been able to actually meet any of these guys except online. But they have invited me to join the Israeli chess team, even though they know I'm called the missionary. And they know I do have um, a mission here. <laughs> so um, my stuff, I'm going to go to my home page and show you around there real quick. And um, have the Messianic Seal. People ask me, what's a Messianic Seal? Every time I post something on, um, on the website and I've been using Twitter, well, it shows up right here. Like my last entry was the two photos, one of two photos I added um, with the Ortiz family. People can click right here, um, and right here, and there it is. You know, David Ortiz, Laura, and uh, Leah. Okay. And so there's a lot going on here, and um, having fun while ministering. Now, stroll down here, for example. Okay, I have a team going, and I called it, I called it the Holy Macro. Okay, and those little decals of that fish that you, you know, uh, people put on their bumper or, you know, on the trunk of their car and whatnot. Well, okay, um, some people jokingly call it the holy macro. So that why, that's why, the, you know, the logic behind the name there. And, well, I have some people that joined different countries right there. I'm the captain. And Ireland and England. Okay, now... But this is the one I'm really excited about. This is a team that the Israelis invited me to join. Um, and like I said, I've met these guys. You know, conversation comes up. Hey, where do you live? You know, what town and whatnot. One guy lives on a kibbutz. The other guy lives out there. Russian the guy who um, lives in Lod near the airport. And the uh, um, guy lives in Haifa. I think that's in his little name there. And... Oh, she, she's doing good, too. Special queen, she called herself, and I, I gave her a lot of pointers because, see, I'm at board one. I'm the strongest player in this tournament. I'm an asset to the team. 
they can uh you know they can ride my coattail to uh, a victory whatever that it mounts to now here's something uh really pretty interesting too okay i decided a little discipleship program i, I recently uh, put up and i'm giving away all kinds of pointers for these guys make the game strong okay now i have a section i made um and thank god for my computer skills that i can do all of this you know i can come right in here put a background with the messianic seal i can do these things okay uh what must i do to be saved and i call it greasy grace they click on it there it is you know um I tell them my testimony, Eddie, are you Jewish? That goes to that page on our home site. Okay, um, how did you end up as a missionary in Israel? What exactly do you do? When you click on what exactly do you do, it opens up the home page. Okay, um, the, web, the website, it's more than a home page. Okay, um, um, what's with the Messianic seal? Click on that, and it gives you, you know, low down there. Okay, in case of rapture, please claim when. Okay, this is, see, each game that we play, you might have 10 days to make a move or five days to make a move. Depends on the tournament um, um, description. Well, people want to win, and um, if you're by any means necessary, and see, you can win if your time, your opponent's time runs out. So, and that's called claiming a win. So, people want to claim wins. And uh, in case of rapture, please claim wins. This is interesting, very intriguing for the, a chess player that's here at the site. They come here, they click on this, and this is what they face with. Matthew chapter 24, verse 42. What's there for? For you do not know the hour your Lord is coming. I want you to know that Jesus. With my computer, I can take this and put it various places, all over the place. Um, I just praise God for the skills. Um, now, what if, what is the rapture? Go and show them something on that. You know, what if I'm left behind? Then what? So um, I answer those questions for them. So this gets wild. Um, we have a little system that we call giving a person a goodie after the game is over, okay? And, uh, you know, most people give beers. A lot of people give handshakes and, um, you know, whiskey and wine and champagne and Christmas trees, cigars. So, you know, at one time I, I, I wouldn't receive any of those and, uh, you know, it's like because I didn't want to offend anybody, like the legalists or something. And, uh, you know, and um, I'm working with a lot of secular people, and they're saying, hey, how come you, you know, you, you know, you, I don't want to frighten them off. They think I'm so righteous that I won't take a, a uh, virtue beer from them or a virtue cigar. <laughs> so uh, I put them back on, you know, and uh, wow, you know, it's just, it's, it's, I don't think it's a, a big sin. But anyhow, I better go. My time is about up. And uh, hope you enjoyed. Got a little overview of uh, what's going on here. Um, and um, really ministering to a lot of people. They come to me with their problems, actually. And I've been able to uh, give them answers from the Bible. It's been a big help. Well, Continue praying for me, and I run this race.